I just landed in London and it's nearly two o'clock. Took some time to get here. It's a bit of a difficulty, but we managed to do it. Now, I'm gonna grab something to drink, which I already have, my green juice. And then, I'm gonna have some scrambled eggs and a coffee. And I'm gonna see one client. I've got to train myself, finally. And there's a little bit of a problem, that's why you're probably seeing this video just now or later. It's because every time I try to upload something in Germany, it either aborted, my, my laptop was empty, whatever happened, so it always got broken down. And then I just arrived here and now my landlord says, well, the internet is shut off here as well. So I'm basically screwed if I can't get the video to upload, so that's why you're probably seeing it just now. this button here boom back online all right this way your camera stays nice and steady and you can sort of do these kind of moves here up and down to the side and now we're gonna go and train <laughs> weight so far uh, normally I did that with 50 kilos on top like in between my legs as weight on top but I'm working my way towards that again you know as as I said when you start out with your workout you don't start where you stopped the first time around you're gonna try to go back into that training so 50 was at my peak of training I was able to push that with a dip and my shoulder was strong Remember I had a tossy two, so I ripped two of my bands in the shoulder. That's why this one is sticking out compared to here. Here's flat, over here you can see this thing popping out. So that's still an injury from a very, very early snowboard accident, but it's not keeping me from doing dips because I still want to do muscle ups and stuff. The doctor said to me, Mark, you're never going to be able to raise your arm over your head again, like this. That's what I say. <laughs> finished my work and actually I need to get changed because yeah I finished right so it's now exactly nine o'clock I don't know if you can see that so that's basically my day and it was quite quite a long day so yeah I'm to be fair what I want to do now I know this uh, vlog is quite short or shorter than the normal vlogs and I didn't want to make it too long but I want to quickly talk about how I feel in terms of this workout and everything. Now, one thing I'm quite sad about is that I can't get all my workouts in just because I don't have the time. But at the same time, I'm trying my best, right? And this is what I'm 
trying to portray to you and I wish that you could do the same that don't get discouraged just because you can't hit every single workout you want. My priority is I said I need to hit every gym workout like the weightlifting that was I need to do that and I need to do the stretching. All the other stuff the martial arts and all that obviously it is a necessity to do that as an as an actor but if I have 10 clients and that's the money I earn in a day or if I choose to train twice a day I'd rather do the 10 sessions and do one session of, of workouts because again it's not going to determine a major difference over the four months period if I did two two sessions a day or one session a day. The main important thing, I showed up and I stuck to my diet. That will make the big difference. Just to, to bear that in mind, guys. And yeah, I mean, so far, I'd say everything is working out really well. Oh, the other thing I want to talk about in terms of how I feel is when I meant how I feel is that I do physically do feel tired. Yeah, I'm not gonna neglect that and say everything is fine. More or less everything is hurting. Yeah. My my back is hurting, my arms, my legs, my my inner thighs, everything is really hurting. But in a good way. So muscular pain. My groin issue for some reason is not as bad as I thought, which is really good, because it did hold me back with the with the deadlifts, as you've seen if I don't know what it was, 120 or something which I deadlifted and I normally work out with 160 kg so there's there's room for improvement but I'm not going to kill myself now just because I can't lift that like I said in the video before it's, it's not about hitting your personal best just when you started training right I mean we do have to be realistic if you have a break then make sure that I mean the effect of having a break like I did like over three months or even more where it didn't do really anything you can't you're not gonna go back to to the way you were with with no effort at all, right? So that's my little rant for today. I packed everything out, everything is set for tomorrow. Need my headphones. Did I have a jacket? One second. Got my, my little mini jacket here coming up. I look like whoever. Anyway, that was it for me from today. Leave your comment comment box below. I'll see you guys today i don't know what day tomorrow is eight nine ten whatever you you're gonna know when you see this video see you guys tomorrow